Howdy folks, Blues Boy Jag, yet another cigar box guitar. This is a custom design for a customer. This is an actual album cover of Otis Redding's. This is obviously a three stringer single coil. The pickup is embedded in the box. Those screws hold the pickup in. And they pick up the sound from the strings. This is a black neck. Signed and numbered, this little doohickey here allows you to lower or raise the strings. If you pull this neck down just a bit by tightening that screw, it will raise the strings. When I say pull the neck down, you're only pulling it down maybe a quarter of an inch. And that raises the strings. If you loosen this, this uh, screw right there, then it will bring the neck up, which lowers the strings. Hard to explain, but the neck goes up, strings are closer to the fretboard. So that gives you a little bit of extra play there, so you can tweak it to your heart's desire. So I put a coat of Mod Podge after I put the artwork on here, and the Mod Podge is all that shiny stuff, and you can see, if you look close, you'll see the, uh, the uh, paintbrush effect on there, if you look real close. And then on top of that, I'll put about six or eight coats of polyurethane to protect the whole shooting match. I make all my cigar box guitars with the same basic setup. Strings are connected with the screws on the back. You tighten and tune, tighten and tune, tighten and tune when you first put the strings on, just like any guitar. You, you got to pull the strings, tighten them, and then tune it back up, pull them again, tighten them. Do it about three or four times. And it stays in tune. These screws hold the strings perfectly in. This one has a fret, believe it or not, for a bridge. And when you put these together, sometimes you, uh, I'll need a bigger bolt. Sometimes I use a really small bridge. In this case, it's a real fret. Those screws hold the fret in the proper position. So you just shove it up against those screws whenever you put the new set of strings on. It is a floating bridge. It will fall off when you remove the strings. Floating bridge bridges have been around since 1500s, 1600s with violins and that sort of thing. And this is a three stringer, as you can see, generally, most of the time, I tune these G, D, G. This is a fifth string from a regular electric guitar set, a fourth string, and a third string. So you got G, D, G. Fifth string tuned down to a G. The D is a D and the G is a G. So it's the five, four, three string configuration. Five, four, three. All right, this is how she sounds. You can use different strings instead of the 543 config. You can use 654, you can use 323, 111, 255, just a million different ways that you can experiment with these. And you can come up some really cool riffs, even just on a three string. This is open tune, Keith Richards basically, open G, a trillion, 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 trillion times a billion times 300 million point five divided by 16 different songs over the years have been written and recorded on a three string open tune G cigar box guitar or a six string open tune G cigar box guitar. Get on YouTube, learn a bunch of songs. Play rock songs on these, country, blues, just whatever your little art desires. If I can play it properly.
again, thank you for watching. Thanks for kind support. Check out my website, jagshouse.com, J-A-G-S-H-O-U-S-E.com. Been around since 2004 making cigar box guitars by hand. I've made over 4,000. This is 4407. And I make three stringers, four stringers, six stringers. I make one string dilly bows, two string dilly bows. Those are fretless dowel necks, and you play with a slide only. I also make dilly bows with a regular neck like this, but it's fretless. I uh, make a three string fretless little mojo, L I L apostrophe, little, little mojo. That's a fretless, just like this, same specs. Got a single coil or a humbucker, three string. That's a with the fretless neck is a little mojo. I also put humbucker pickups in my models. If you so choose, I put dual pickups, dual single coil, dual humbuckers, one humbucker, one single coil, one piezo, one single coil. Once again, thanks for watching. Thanks for your kind support and toodles.